Got text capture, cloud console, new survey tab, zoom window, which allows for a faster, more precise marking of the points. You can also mark multiple points in a single image using a right-click drop-down menu. And once the block is arrow triangulated, you can see estimated positions of other points in the photo. Step one is to create a new project and then import the photos and survey points. Step two is to open the survey dialog and mark the ground control points. Here you will find the zoom window to make the more precise marking easier and faster. You can also use the right click drop down menu to mark multiple points in a single photo quickly. You can then run the AT, step three. And then step four will be to go back to the survey dialog, click the show all potential positions button and this will show the estimated position for points that have not been marked yet based off of the AT. You can then mark additional points quickly. So we will start with a new project in the cloud console here. And we will start by adding our photos. And then we will add our survey points. Once our survey points are in, we will select them and start marking the points. You can see here we get this zoomed in window on the target. As I move it around, be a more accurate area of where we're marking it, and then I can move it around there in the zoom in window to really get a precise position. As with all ground control points, we want to mark it in at least three photos. Now in this photograph we are in, we can see there are multiple ground control points. So we can quickly mark them by right clicking on the point and set the position in this drop down menu here. And we can do the same there by just moving it slightly and marking the position to what we want it at. Once we have our three photos marked, we can go back to our, back out of the survey tab and we can submit a calibration. This will upload to the cloud and run an arrow triangulation for us. When your calibration is done, you can then create a new version down here. Go into our survey dialog again, and you're gonna to wanna to make sure the button in the top right corner marked show slash hide all potential positions is enabled. And you can then click on the points and very quickly mark them. This will show estimates for all the other points and you can use it as a, a double check your AT by just seeing how the point is denoted. It also makes it very fast to mark them using the same old method as before. You can see this is GCP8, so we can click there and then use our right click menu, mark, yes. And that's some of the new improvements in the survey tab in update 3 of the Context Capture Cloud Console.